talk. Here we are, Ford Lake, and uh, this is my biggest carp yet, and my first carp here. Yep, 11, 11 pounds. pounds. How many ounces? 11 pounds, 3 ounces. 11 pounds, 3 ounces. And we're about to release him. We'll go release him. Put him in the net, and we'll go release him. Let him revive, though, in the net really quick for just a little bit. Here, hold the camera really quick. Hold the camera. Really want to... Take the gloves off. You don't need them. You're going to be in the water. You don't even need gloves to hold the carp. Oh, I hate the slime. Whatever, just come on. I can't stand it. Hold this really quick. Let me put it in the water for you. I got bit by a horse fly. Are you Yeah. Hey, give me the camera. Just let him revive a little bit. Let him revive a little bit. Don't go that way. Bring him out deep, just a little bit deeper. Okay, there we go. Deep as he needs to be. I'm just letting hey, these rocks again. You can lower the net now. Okay, do you want to grab them? Here, take a picture of them. That's my size. How's mine? There he goes. Okay. Okay, man. Stop recording. Hey. Um. Well, we're doing pretty good today so far. We've gotten four fish in maybe a couple hours. It's only about two o'clock maybe. And um, so far I've caught two fish, Andrew's caught two fish, and Brennan's still has to catch one, but. So we're doing good. We've caught two 11 pound carp today, one 15 pound carp, and a small catfish. And I recently was over in this spot. That's where I caught the 15 pounder, but now I'm back over here. So. I'm already getting some bites. My alarm went off. Maybe just well, each alarm went off once already there, and so let's <coughs> wait to get another fish then. See what happens. Hey, it's Austin and. Well, I've been fishing for a while now since the last video that I made, and, um, well, my friend just had a fish on, but his reel got tangled at the bottom. He lost it, and it took the hook off because he didn't have to tie it well enough. And then, well, I've been seeing some really big carp roll around on top of the water right out here. So I decided to give my rods a try right here. It's getting really sunny out. That's why I'm wearing these glasses right now. It's starting to get hot, too. We actually want the water to cool off, so... Yep, I'm just trying to hopefully I'll catch some right here. A lot of big ones jumping right here. Just kind of surfacing, rolling around on the surface. Was getting some bites earlier, but now they're not really biting. Something actually rolled around on top of my line and made it beep once, but just rolled around on top of it. So here's my friends. There's my friends like way over there. I can't even see them right now. Well, hopefully we catch them. Okay. Hey, I haven't really had much luck now. I my right rod that I was getting bites on. I just tried setting the hook on that one because it honestly looked like something was on because it wouldn't stop bending the rod. But because I was set the hook because I didn't know I didn't know what to think it was. I could have been a catfish, maybe small catfish. But I've never seen a carp bite like that before. Went to set the hook, nothing was on, so. Just recasted that one out there. Actually got both my rods out there. I fixed my hair rig up, so you know. Hopefully we'll catch something with that new cast. I heard someone bring them bring them area five. Yeah.
He's gonna be maybe a, is he's over 15, he looks. I'd say 14. He looks maybe 14 to 15 pounds. If he's not recording. Okay, well, hey, uh, so Austin, got another beautiful carp. 15, pound, 15 pounds, 2 ounce carp. Right before we were gonna leave, too, so I'm really happy with this fish. I love the fighting. Well, here we are releasing this beautiful 15 pound common carp I caught. Second 15 pounder today, so I'm really happy with today. Just gonna let him revive. Oh, you gotta be kidding me, he's hooked again.